discuss the podcast interview that made headlines. And joining me right now via Skype is Rolling Out Magazine's Crystal Jordan. Good morning to you, Crystal. Good morning. Good morning, Sharon. How are you? I'm doing well. I'm doing well. This all stems from T.I. reportedly saying he goes with his daughter to the doctor's office to make sure that she's still a virgin. What's your take on all of this? Well, you know, he was he was doing a podcast interview and he was talking about the fact that he's very involved in his daughter's life and that uh, he's very protective. If you've been a fan of T.I., anyone anyone who's been a fan of his knows that he's very protective of his family. Um, they have a show on VH1, uh, Family Hustle, where you see him being very active in all his children's lives. So it wasn't a surprise to hear that he's a very protective father. I think that the fact that he used... Uh, a particular term saying that he checks with the gynecologist, set some people off. Uh, Tarana Burke, Gloria Steinham were very upset. A lot of feminists spoke out about the fact that he should not be doing, uh, making his daughter's body something that was a possession of his. He should not be in control of that. So that caused a big stir. Uh, of course, he and Tiny, like you said, went to Red Table Talk to sit down and uh, allow Jada Pinkett to kind of add some clarity to the situation red table talk has become that platform that celebrities actually trust and has the credibility on both sides of the fans and the celebrities so i think that was a great uh, a great platform for him to address it but he did say he had no no plans to address it unless his daughter felt comfortable after he made the statement it went crazy his daughter was embarrassed and she asked him not to speak about it anymore not to defend himself or anything and so he didn't but when she decided that she was okay with him going and and talking about it he decided to go to red table talk and the conversation went really well. I think people were able to see that he was exaggerating a bit. He was not actually in the exam room with his daughter. Her mother was there also. He's just a very concerned father. And I think that he was being humorous. And, you know, if uh, if some people don't know his personality, it might have been taken out of context. It also was a teachable moment for him. Uh, Jada and her mother were able to explain to him why women were so insulted and why, uh, his words, you know, had such an effect on some women that may not have had that experience with the father in the home. Yeah. But I think overall, it was a great, a great way for him to clarify his um, his statement and for people to see that he's really just a concerned father. And we have to make a place for concerned fathers in parenting in the right space. It definitely did open up a lot of dialogue and he was able to talk to his, his family about it as well and share with the public as well, too. Crystal, Absolutely. thank you so much for joining us. Absolutely. Thank you. And you can follow Crystal on Instagram at Enchanted.